So in order to look at this, we'll do a simple conversion. Let's take a normal speed of a car, 60 kilometers per hour. And what we want to do is we want to convert it to meters per second. So the first thing we need to do is we need to think about, well, how many meters is this? So remember that a kilometer is a thousand. So this is actually 60,000 meters every hour. Now, next thing we want is actually seconds. So how many seconds are there in an hour? Well, there's 60 minutes. And 60 minutes is 60 times 60 seconds. So that's 3,600 seconds. So we've got this distance, 60,000 meters in 3600 seconds but we don't want 3600 seconds we want one second so we need to divide both sides then by 3600 so if we divide this side by 3600 this side by 3600 we're going to end up with one second because 3600 divided by 3600 is one and then if we divide this side, we'll end up with the actual meters covered in that one second, which is 16.67 meters. So we've done the conversion. Now, if you're not really into remembering all of that, then you can think about what we actually did here was we multiplied one side by a thousand and we divided by 3600. So to actually convert between kilometers per hour and meters per second, it is as simple as dividing by 3.6, the magic number. So if you take 60 and divide by 3.6, you'll get this measurement and you don't need to remember any of this. So let's look at it the other way. Let's take 21 meters per second and convert it to kilometers per hour. So we know how far it'll go in one second. We've got to ask ourselves how we're going to get to hours. Well, one second, 60 seconds, one minute, 60 minutes, one hour. So to get the second up to one hour, we would need to multiply by 3600. 60, just put in there 60 times 60. But 60 minutes, 60 seconds. So we're going to times that side by 3600. So we need to times this side also by 3600. And what we'll end up with is meters per hour. 75600 meters per hour. Now we don't want meters, we want kilometers. So what we need to do is divide this one by a thousand. That'll bring us back to, to, to kilometers. So 75.6 kilometers per hour. Now let's think about what we did. We multiplied this number by 3600. We divided by a thousand. So in reality, if you want to convert from meters to seconds, meters per second to kilometers per hour, all you need to do is multiply by the magic number 3.6 and you will end up with that conversion. To sum it up then, if the simplest way to remember your conversions is that if you were in kilometers per hour and you want meters per second, we get there by dividing the number by 3.6. If you are in meters per second and you want kilometers per hour, we get that conversion by multiplying the number by 3.6.